As Sexual Awareness Month continues, advocacy groups joined forces to speak up for sexual assault survivors on Denim Day. Our reporter Ruby Cordova was there. I believe that this is a system that is built on patriarchy. In the heart of Los Angeles, Peace Over Violence joined with the public and wore denim to support those who have been victims of sexual assault. We did not ask for it. I did not ask for it. The crowd cheered as speakers came to the podium to share their stories. Domestic violence specialist Alexis Contreras helped organize the event to educate others. Only a platform to signify like the importance of today and to um, amplify our platform of we are here, we are present, we're here to help you. There is still no excuse for invitation to rape. CEO Patty Giggins started the denim campaign 23 years ago following an incident in Europe where a woman was blamed for her choice of clothing. Giggins says she'll continue to protest until laws and attitudes are changed. And we're going to continue to make fashion statements and social statements until we really put an end to it. Some sexual assault survivors read poems and others spoke about the importance of this movement. Ana Santa Maria wants change for the sake of all victims. Because in this case, it could be an old man, a young man, a child, a woman. So the commitment that we acquired for this movement is so important for our community. April 27th is now being recognized as National Denim Day by Mayor Eric Garcetti. Though this is Peace Over Violence's first in-person rally, they plan to conduct more in the future. Reporting from Los Angeles for Valley View News, I'm Ruby Cordova.